Otherwise, let it sit in the back. Okay, there is a one page here. Did you read 10 Rules of My Life? Those who got the package. 10 Rules of My Life. What page is it? Page 6. Page 6. Those who don't have it, we'll work together with you. Okay, wherever you are, close the eyes. Put everything away, close the eyes. Title is 10 Rules of My Life. In the name of Allah, in the name of God, 10 Rules of My Life. I am saying here, okay? first person, my life. That applies to me. Okay? Now if you say in your mind, before I go further, those, those 10 rules will be your life. See, if you sing the same song, then it applies to the personality who is reciting it. Okay? and rules of my life. If you say it within your mind, they will become your rules of life. We shall never, please keep your eyes closed, we shall never find faults, so help us God. We shall love, look for good, and go about doing good, so help us God. We shall never criticize nor condemn anyone, so help us God. Accept constructive criticism for teachers. We shall never enslave anyone, so help us God. We shall never speak or boast of ourselves, so help us God. We shall be truthful in our thoughts, acts, and deeds, so help us God. We shall have compassion for all the beings in the universe, so help us God. We shall eliminate the negative hindering of a higher path, so help us God. We shall meditate in the name of Allah, God, our beloved Father, so help us God. We shall work for honest living, so help us God. Amen. On the next page is a single personality and dual personality composites. Very, very powerful. What's going on in the whole world today is on these two pages. Single personality. We have two parts in ourselves. One is conscious, one is subconscious. Conscious always orders. Always orders. It relates to our doctor, our teacher, our parent. Master, the decision maker. 
there's a door in us. One side is the master, other side is the student. Subconscious and conscious area in the brain. Subconscious is the follower. Conscious is the making order, decision making. Subconscious is the upper. Like uh, mind, conscious mind, chitan mind, up chitan. Chitan is the conscious mind. Chitan. One and upchitan, upchitan, higher level, subconscious mind. As a student, patient, disciple, doer, only does, Atma only does, this part belongs to the Atma, Atma only does, that's where our health concept comes. If you don't like your body or you don't, don't love your body, you say it in your mind, she listens to it, it records it, and it's recorded. So a doer only does the memory bank. It sits in the memory. And that book only opens when we die. That book is written until the last breath it only opens somewhere after we die, where we pay our consequences, what we did in this life. So this is a single personality composite, conscious and subconscious area. If we apply this, do this, do that, to a dual personality, and we are in this composite, in this combination, our conscious part is directing, do this, do that. And if you opt out, like somebody saying, I don't like the light, I want to be dark here. You know? So you will never be in the same group of therapy. But if you all do like, a, we were doing exercise, do the um, hand pump. What are you all doing? Right? When we were standing, doing the exercise, pumping the water. This is the conscious part. There is the subconscious part. Doing as you are told. If that happens in the house, it's at the smallest level. That happens in the municipality, it's the higher level than the house level. It starts from the family. Everything, health, wealth, disease, starts from the house and grows bigger. Okay. That goes at the country level. If everybody does what we were told, there will be peace, right? Number one. You say, I did it yesterday. Why should I do it today? Like it happens between brothers and sisters at the home. You know. Let him do that today. Why are you asking me again today? Wherever why starts, fight starts. So this is happening in the countries on a large scale. If we are perfectly organized, the way we are doing, here, 100% success. Otherwise, if one is opted out, it will be 99% success. And it happens in the large scale between countries now, like you and area. So it starts at a small level here, and then it goes bigger in the dual personality. But it's a dual personality shown how we do this. Okay. For instance, now you hold your finger like this, okay, on the front. Close your eyes and move the finger towards the nose. Start bringing the finger towards the nose.
this is exactly what happens when you are agreeing with master. If you opt out, you say, why should I? It just won't be there, what you are trying to do. Okay. Open your eyes. So this is this page, very, very powerful. And it is uh, originally in this one, in this book. This is modified here. It comes from this source of knowledge. Rest, you have seen the recipes here, flu remedy, eye drops, everything is here for our physical life, physical fitness. What is here given to you is for your physical fitness. Rest is automatic. Okay. Leading to the higher level of life is automatic. Okay. Your breath is a starting point for the higher level of life. First you start in the dark to, for, for instance, uh, you, you know when you celebrate your children's birthday, spread your legs, relax at the same time. You celebrate your child's birthday. Okay. So the candle is lit. What do you do when the candle is lit? You blow it. Huh? What is it? Yeah, you sing, but at the same time, happy, with the happy birthday, you are blowing the candle, right? Right. Okay. Let's, let's get the esoteric meaning of it. This is the exoteric. You blow the candle out. Okay. It's like the takri cross on the church. Shiva Ji Tarsun Khanda in the forehead. Okay? They have exoteric meanings, what we see with the eyes. And there is an esoteric meaning for higher life, for higher understanding. Okay. You blow the candle. What happens? You blow the candle. And you are saying, lead us from light to darkness. <laughs> it's the asymptotic meaning. In our prayer, we say, Asatoma Satgama. Lead us from untruth to truth. From negative side of concept to positive side. Tamasoma Jyotagama. Lead us from darkness to light. But when you are blowing the candle, you are reciting in your subconscious level, lead us from light to darkness. So there is a contradiction to creation. Please understand it. God is part of Atma. Atma is part of God. They only do what you say. It's recorded. See, you all remembered when I said, when you blow the candle, what you say with the dial candle. Relative parts are starting from the subconscious. So you have to watch what we say in our life. We have to watch what we think because they are being recorded. Okay? Don't say, nobody sees me, let's steal something or do something. They are recorded within you. Within you. Okay. On your Jamraj Karan Jamaji. They are 
खड़ा हमेशा लौटता है सो दीज थिंग्स आर इंपॉर्टेंट सो इन अदर वर्ड्स वी शुड ऑलवेज वॉच वट वी से हाउ वी से इवन आवर टोन इज रिकॉर्डेड विद वट टोनैलिटी इट वॉज रिकॉर्डेड एंड दैट टोनैलिटी इज रिपीटेड इन द कोर्ट हाइस कोर्ट हाउ यू सेट इट and punishment or reward is also accordingly given to the personality with what tone it was said how how sensitive it is you know very very sensitive area so if we if we speak loud we take a lot of energy we want to conserve energy we always with, with the breath we always uh, when you are breathing deep you will never be able to speak too fast number one though some people are speak so fast i don't know they are ancestral of course their parents also probably speak too fast but remember your brain cell that is activated must go through a rest period which is 25 milliseconds before you should speak out another word that thought if it does not we lose the energy level in the brain center and your energy profile becomes too sharp around 12 o'clock after 12 o'clock it goes to to the zero point which is number 4 i think breathing wave form This is page three, by the way. Page three, uh, yawning versus freshness. This is my personal 35 years waveform. Okay. How I was when I used to drink and non-veg and all that, and I sometimes say in my classes that I used to. not usually drinking heavily but uh, heavily drinking with the friends very occasionally overboard in other words and uh, and i say where i was i used to pee outside the toilet maybe it happened only once in my life but it's an example recorded okay every politician says i did this i did that but nobody says i did bad you have to spit out all what you were before to bring the other people other personalities up in physical problems so does not matter what we were doing we want to know what we are now okay now are you happy today are you happy today yes, yes. Are you happy now? Yes. Are you happy at this present moment? Yes. See the present is getting smaller and smaller. I'll send you another poem. I said we talk about centuries to years and months and day on the day we get married how happiness peaks, you know? I wrote on this. and all of a sudden after four or seven when you are not given the proper gifts you expected what happens in two hours all that happiness there down this is how it happens if you celebrate your birthday every morning as soon as you step your foot on the floor then your happiness will be leveled to 365 days you won't fall down when it's leveled like that if you go peak and fall down and up and down you still have, did you get angry in the last 3 days anybody got angry in the last 3 days please be truthful 
Okay, no problem. In future, if that happens, this is the truth of 1982. My teacher saying to me, I'm repeating it. Okay, simply repeating it. If you ever get hang angry, you know now that it takes time to get angry. You know you're going to get angry. In other words, there's a few millisecond, few few seconds that you know I'm going to get angry now. Okay. If you ever do that again, you 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 will know you recognize the anger. Just take one breath and your eyes automatically close when you learn this. When you take a deep breath, you go into a different world when the breath is going in. See, my eyes get closed when I breathe in. If it ever happens that way. And you hold the breath for momentary time, fraction of a second. And you open up angry mouth. The words will be different. You have to practice it. We all used to get angry. I was the worst one, I would say. Amongst all of you, I was the worst one. But now, don't you bottle up? That's the bottle of me up we are talking about. We want to control it with a single breath we are We give you a tool. Okay? You have to practice this tool, then you experience it. When I when you meet next time, then you express your feelings, how you felt, how you experienced it. We have done that. Okay. We know what anger does. We have lots of energy we are gaining from God given gift. Okay? That energy converts into negative in no moments. You can kill, you can stab during that time. Okay? It won't happen any time in your life if you know how to use the breath as a tool. It is God given positive gift. So that's the tool for the anger. Because once you keep this energy level always positive, it will only accumulate. Otherwise, you know how your body shakes when you are angry? Reach that level of anger? Body shakes. And it takes weeks to come back to that level. Yes. To normal level. It doesn't come back right away. Your, st your mouth starts, your face starts shaking. Your speech uh, even becomes uh, impaired. For a moment, you cannot even talk. It's like a drunk with the bottle in. Can't even talk when we are angry. Words don't come out, you know, or because all the energy is drained out quickly. And what we don't realize after we stab somebody or kill somebody, then we realize I've made a mistake. But that time you are already in the jail. What would you do? No. So, if you are responsible for any action in your life, like as engineers, we have to sign a document. We are responsible for our own actions. Then, should you move your hands back or like this? Get me punishment or reward if you are ready for it. If you are truthfully responsible for your own actions in life, your hands will be like this, not hiding behind. That means we can get punishment or reward. You are called enlightened when your hands are open like this. So much. Stand on your knees. You feel it in the hip area, the sex. 
changing over on the knees. You feel it here in the hip area. So you can see the weakest area in the body is the low back area, where the last rib, rib cage is caught inside. So don't let it collect dust. Every page is a personal. Okay. Nothing here in this you will find in any book that equalizing the brain hemisphere on both sides the same. You see the stars there. It's explained how to use it it's to be given to the children to train both brains hemispheres uh, exercise for tracing the star in the mirror. Okay. Tracing the star in the mirror is explained on the page. Okay. Children should practice this right now so their potential will be equalized on both sides equally as they grow up. What's the child's name? What is your name, Betty? What's your name, Betty? I can't hear, I'm deaf. Louder? When you, when you fight with your mommy or daddy or other children, you shout so loud. Now you are not saying loudly. What is it? Do you know the meaning of your name? You don't? My name is Moor Bachchan. Where did your teeth, where did you leave your teeth? At home? I can't see your teeth. Were you forced to bring it, come here? Did mommy force you to come? You came yourself? But she told you you should go. But she didn't force you, right? She wouldn't be happy if she was forced. Face reads itself. Okay. Somebody told me, can, can he bring his child, his uh, six-year-old? He didn't come. Oh, you? Ah, okay, you are the one who is coming. Okay, okay. Great. Okay, we want to finish all four sets today. Then we're going to do a back exercise. We're going to repeat because there are more back problems. Okay. We are doing more physical work outside. The temperature is low. Remember one thing. I had the same problems as you have. Okay. I could sit two, two minutes, uh, not more than two minutes in 1982. Now I can sit on the same back 14 hours. But it doesn't mean I don't get up and walk around every two hours. So I follow the rules of physical life. Okay. You will be better to contribute more if you be regular with it. You have to be regular with it. Okay. Don't say, I will not do it today and I'll do it uh, at the weekend. And weekend, some guests come in and you miss the whole week. Body knows. It sets its record that you didn't do. Okay. Because when you do next time, like I, our mother, uh, we used to get competition with brothers. We used to do sit ups. Okay. We used to do sit ups. And we used to 